Let's go over some more rules in trigonometric functions. If you have sine of minus theta, it is minus sine theta. Meaning, if I have sine minus 60 degrees, right, that would be minus sine 60, which is minus root 3 over 2, right, because sine 60 is root 3 over 2, so minus times root 3 over 2 is minus root 3 over 2, right. And next, sorry, next would be cos. Cosine of minus theta is plus cosine theta. You see, for sine, minus theta is minus sine theta. For cosine, it's positive. It doesn't matter if you're negative angle or positive angle. Right? It's still positive. Tan of minus theta would be minus tan theta. Right? Now you tell me how about cosecant theta of minus theta. What about cosecant of minus theta? Right. It is just 1 over sine theta. So if sine theta is negative, this also should be negative. So it's minus cosecant theta. Right. How about secant theta? Minus secant of minus theta. Right, because secant is 1 over cos theta. If cos theta is positive, no matter what your angle is, then this will also be positive, right? Plus secant theta. How about cot? Cot of minus theta. Since your tan is negative for negative angles, your cot also will be negative for negative angles. Right? Now let's do a few examples on this on these lines. So the question states find secant minus pi by four and cos minus ninety. Okay, let's first find secant minus pi by four. What is pi by four? Pi by four radians is equal to pi by four times one eighty or pi. So that would be pi pi cancels away 45 degrees. Oh, 45 degrees. So what is secant minus 45 degrees? Secant minus 45 is positive secant 45, right? Because your cos of minus is positive, so secant also will be positive. And what is secant 45? It is 1 over cos 45 degrees, right? And how much is cos 45? Cos 45 is root 2 over 2. So your secant 45 will be 2 over root 2, or this is equal to root 2. Second question, what is cos of minus 90? <coughs> cos of minus 90 is equal to plus cos 90, right? That's because cos of minus theta is plus cos theta, right? And what is plus cos 90? What is cos 90? It's 1. Oh, sorry. Cos 90 is 0 because sine 90 is 1. So this will be 0. Plus 0 doesn't matter if it's positive or negative. So this is 0. 